Hi students, I am Sunil Kumar Bandaru, press educator in an academy. Students, today I am introducing you All India ranker Mr. Prabhu. He has secured All India second rank in recent SSEJ 2020 exam. So today we are going to know the lot of things from him like preparation strategy and which books he has prepared and time management and many more. Let me invite our ranker Prabhu. Hi Prabhu. Hello sir, thank you. <laughs> uh, how are you Prabhu? Uh, fine sir. Uh, first of all, uh, how is your feeling after getting All India second rank in uh, SCJ 2020 exam? Yes, sir. Feeling very good and uh, now a bit relaxed <laughs> after getting success. <laughs> after that, uh, very relaxing. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's very good. And tell me a little bit about yourself, uh, like your state education, BTEC or diploma, which you have passed out and your percentage and something to our students. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, I am from West Bengal. Uh, I, I have passed my BTEC uh, in 2017. Uh, my in my in my all the semesters I have combined DGP of uh, nine point one three. Nine point one three, very good. Is there any motivation behind your success? Uh, like parents, lecturers, or any institute, or any other, or own motivation, or by any other motivator? Yes, sir. Uh, my parents, uh, my elderly uh, brothers and sisters, and uh, also uh, an academy played a, a big role. In my success and also you your your classes were very helpful thank my you my preparation throughout my journey very good and tell me about your preparation like uh, how we have prepared which books you have followed like that those will be very very useful for our students yes sir uh, so uh, when i started my preparation i followed uh, i started with uh, an academy and uh, i followed all the classes of various educators and uh, i uh, follows uh, i followed your classes uh, then uh, for uh, that for prelims and for mains i uh, for i followed just prelims notes and uh, standard some standard textbooks for some derivations and uh, standard numericals and uh, mains pyqs for mains and for prelims uh, your classes and Normally, an academy is various educators, GS, GK, reasoning classes, I follow. Very good. And which books you have prepared for technical, for prelims and mains? Any theory uh, books you have prepared? For prelims, uh, I, I did not take any book. Uh, with, I, I did not take help of any book. Uh, I followed just class notes and uh, various online materials that were available, uh, various PDFs like that. Uh, but uh, for mains, I followed some standard diploma level books uh, like uh, those available in normal diploma colleges for numerical practices and some derivations because in mains, they ask uh, derivations also uh, and uh, formula, uh, normal formula questions, formula based questions. And uh, for higher level questions means sometimes they actually in 2019, they asked very good uh, numerical questions. So okay. for that, I also prepared uh, gate questions and some uh, EAC uh, level question, EAC mains questions means uh, not EAC very high level questions, and basic level which may come in SSCJ like there some type of questions I practiced. That means as per level of SSCJ you have prepared. Yes, sir. Uh, yes. And particularly any books uh, names can you give the names or two or three or for the students? Uh, books uh, books I think became. Books, uh, Vikram Mehta book is good. Uh, BL Thereja books are okay. good. And uh, if they, if someone wants to prepare for uh, means uh, very high level numericals means above SSC level, then uh, for machines uh, there are PS Vimra books. Okay. And uh, for uh, power system power systems there are various books like uh, Ashpa Hussain, uh, then Vikram Mehta, then. Then some other books also, okay. like uh, uh, JB Gupta, like that. Okay. And one but uh, for SSCJ prelims, I think uh, yes. means from studying from books are not necessary because it will take many time. Yes, yes. Uh, and, and exam comes within one year or one point two year, and uh, within that time only you can finish take. Yes. If you study from books, but uh, if you if you have to score good marks, then you have to follow non take also and reasoning also. Okay. So, and so for, prelims, online uh, also, for prelims MCQs, uh, have you followed any books for practice or only online materials or only practice sessions in 
uh, an academy uh, uh, yeah. uh, in online online an academy i on uh, from online i i, I have taken an academy mc2 classes uh, that were going on that time and also some mock tests on several mock test platforms and also some standard mc2 books i practiced it's very good uh, and how you have managed uh, the time for preparation of all these subjects uh, technical non technical totally 200 questions are there 100 for technical 100 for non technical uh, how is yes. how prepared and uh, that is daily how many hours you have prepared uh, so many students having yeah. about how many hours we have to prepare for getting the job like that na yes, yes. so but how, many, uh, how else you have prepared yes. yes tell me tell me yes 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 uh, so i uh, i i have not that uh, i means i i have not followed that particular routine means i have to study for 8 hours today or for 10 hours today like that uh, and some students also follows like uh, 4 hours take 2 hours non take or 4, four hours take 2 hours uh, gk and uh, 1 hour reasoning like that i have not followed such uh, strategies i i have just followed uh, means uh, my strategy was uh, if i study uh, take uh, then whole day i used to study take and if I study non-tech, uh, whole, not whole day, uh, means 70% uh, of the time I follow take, take and 30% non-tech and um, reasoning I have not followed that much, means uh, reasoning uh, I followed just uh, before one month of exam I practiced and mock test given, that were enough and for GK I have given whole year, means okay, okay. for GK I used to study regularly. Uh, can you, can you uh, elaborate a little bit about non-technical part, why because other students feel very very tough it is, uh, uh, how you have prepared for that, uh, give me in uh, two to three minutes, then it will be very helpful for all those. Yes, like I uh, said, uh, cutoff of uh, 2000. 19 SSC JE prelims was uh, 157 approx. Okay. So uh, if a student gets mean uh, average on average 80 marks, I say 75 to 80 marks. Okay. The, that was 157 was uh, normalized score. Means uh -huh. uh, that time uh, 15 to 20 marks got increased. Means raw marks were near to 140. Okay. So if some students score 70, 75 in take, means uh, he has to score 70, 75 in non take also okay then uh, for that also uh, reasoning plays a very important part because you need to score minimum 40 to 45 in reasoning okay. above 45 means uh, nowadays reasoning paper also getting difficult uh, because reasoning standard they are getting means reasoning is getting standard question uh, day by day so getting 45 in reasoning is very good score so 45 from that side and if we get 30 if we get 30 in uh, gk section that will be sufficient i think 30 to 32, 33 uh, were sufficient, will be sufficient. Okay. And if someone gets approx 25 also, then no problem because in 25 in GK and uh, 45 in reasoning, in 60 marks, then he has to score 80 to 80, 85 at least in technical. So there should be a balance between technical and non-technical. Yes, yes. Because my, uh, many of the students uh, uh, scored 85 in technical, but uh, in non-tech section, they got out of 160. 50 marks 45 marks and they just missed cut off by one or two months yes so that's why i said in so many of our classes non-technical part will play a very important role in the selection yes, yes. and uh, in ssc j 2020 uh, how many marks you got in non-technical part per 100 uh, i exactly uh, okay. have not given but but approx i got 149 total uh, out of which i think 80 80 to 85 approx in uh, 80 sorry 80 approx in technical Very and good. remaining uh, reasoning approx i got th uh, 39 or 40 marks and uh, technical i got uh, sorry gk section i got approx 30 marks 30 marks very good very good and uh, that means uh, you are getting very good score in gk 30 plus means that is a very good score so how you have prepared for gk any books you have followed are only an academy classes uh, for non-technical part no, no. Or, uh, how you have prepared for current affairs and all those uh, for gk i followed only an academy classes and uh, any special any special things you want to say about technical part that means any preparation techniques are there for uh, uh -huh. how to share that to the students Yes, uh, so for prelims, uh, mainly, uh, pre exactly, it means in our SSCJ, uh, basically six subjects comes. Uh, basically, electrical means network theory, then measurements, then machines, then power systems, then basic electronics and uh, utilization estimation costing. So, 
uh, most two important subjects are uh, basic electrical and machines from that uh, out of 100 questions at least for, for 35 questions will come right. so we have to start with basic electrical and from basic electrical in ac analysis if we uh, get our ac analysis strong then it will help in uh, machine also and it will help in uh, power system also so we have to start with basic electrical uh, then we have to uh, go to machines then we have to finish power system then we will come to measurements and I, these four are more important most important subjects and then we will come to basic electronics uh, basic electronics and utilization uh, weightage are very less means out of uh, 100 marks uh, total basic electronics and utilization will come maximum 10 to 15 marks Great. so those four subjects uh, machine power system uh, measurement and circuit theory uh, consist of 80 to 85 months. So yeah. for prelims, uh, basically out of 100 questions, uh, they maintain approx 70-30 ratio. Means 70 questions are theoretical, 30 questions are numerical. Uh, so numericals also not, not that much high level. They ask simply formula based level, uh, two to three tricky, tricky questions, calculative questions they ask uh, for time management. Uh, they want to see the time, time management of the students. And out of 70 questions of theory, uh, approx, we will get uh, 5 to 10 databases questions. I mean, if you have read that, you will answer, otherwise you can't answer. And rest 55, 60 questions will come uh, conceptual and general theory uh, that you can answer easily. Okay. And for mains, uh, basically, uh, mains paper consists of 300 marks. You have to answer it in two hours. So we have to answer, uh, they, they will give six questions. Out of those six questions, we have to answer five questions. Okay. Each concern, each questions consist of sixty marks. Okay. So, uh, means you know, uh, all the questions. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes, all the questions. And how so, many? So you have three hundred. Uh, I got sir two eighty eight marks. Two eighty eight. Very good. Very good. And can you suggest any two educators in an academy class uh, for the students who have, who you have followed with, uh, so much of uh, uh, theory uh, covered through so much of theory part and also practice sessions? Yes, sir. I followed your classes uh, means uh, for, since 2019 ending, 2020 starting. I followed uh, then uh, since then I followed your classes, and uh, I one one of the educator also named Ashish Soni, sir. I also followed his classes. Yes. Okay. Okay. And one more thing, uh, I want to ask one important question. So many students asking me also, sir, how we have to manage the time in examination hall. Uh, that is uh, how we can attempt a lot of questions. That is uh, maximum questions. Here, 200 questions, yes. 120 minutes means uh, we have to attempt one question within very, very less than, very, very less time, less than one minute. Yes. So how you have managed, yes. how many questions you have attempted? Uh, so, sir, my strategy was, uh, my technical question was strong. Okay. So I used to start with technical. Uh, how tough the paper, how easy the paper, does not matter. I started always with technical. So first attempt, and we have to attempt in two sections, means uh, we have to attempt in two rounds. So first attempt, uh, five, first from question one to question 100, we have to see which questions we are getting directly, means theory questions or easy numerical or simple conceptual theory questions we have to answer. Means uh, suppose uh, out of 100 questions, we are getting 60 questions in first round, okay. 60 questions. So we have to answer 60 questions within approx 40 to 45 minutes at max. Okay. 40 to 45 minutes at max. Then I, I used to move to reasoning section Basically. because it takes a lot of time. Reasoning means nowadays they are getting difficult and difficult. Okay. So uh, reasoning, I used to take approx 40 minutes. I, I used to attempt 40 questions, so one minute per questions. Okay. So uh, 40 and 60, 100 questions attempted. Then I used to go to uh, GK section. Okay. GK section, I used to solve in one, one go, means not no, second round is not needed, one round you can easily do. Okay. So 50 questions, it will take maximum of 10 minutes, maximum of 10 minutes it will take. So 45, then 40, 85 and 10, 90, within 95 minutes, uh, we will finish 60, 40, 100, 150 questions. So we have got 25 minutes and 50 questions. Now we can come to the electrical section and uh, solve those uh, tricky numerical and tricky conceptual questions and that will be beneficial for all means uh, then we can attempt at least 170 to 180 questions in two hours okay okay that means you have two rounds for technical part 
So in one go, all the theory part and small uh, uh, simple, yes. simple questions, and in the second go, wherever the difficult questions and you have attempted like that, then uh, in that way you have managed your time. And what about yes. negative marking? That is, uh, have you attempted any unknown questions also, or uh, uh, any probability? That is, uh, for yes, options, is there any two? Probability uh, means I, I I used to follow like uh, if if I if suppose uh, I attempted in GK thirty questions, 30 questions. Uh, out uh, thirty questions. So thirty questions I know suppose genuinely means I know hundred oh. percent it will be correct. Then I, I used to take risk in uh, means uh, in SSC J, uh, JE they follow uh, uh, one one fourth uh, negative means if we wrong four questions if we get incorrect four questions one mark will be deducted. So I used to take chances minimum four to five questions in GK. Okay. Same goes for reasoning. It will be very less. Uh, maximum one to two question. I used to take risk, and technical also same four to five question. Mean approx you can re take risk in eight to ten questions. Okay. Eight to ten question you can take risk because it will get maximum one or two or three negative mark. Okay. That will not much affect uh, your result. Okay. And one more thing. Uh, give any some suggestion uh, to the students. Uh, two or three suggestions. From you, uh, suggestion means uh, you have to be consistent. Uh, you have to study regular, and uh, all not always study. It means entertainment also needed. Uh, I used to use sports, movies, web series like that. You have to maintain time. Time management is uh, very important, uh, and also with calm mind, you you have to give exam. Then it will be all fine. Okay, and okay, okay, and one thing. Uh, you got all India second rank, and uh, what is the difference between you and uh, first ranker? What is what are the marks uh, marks difference between you and first ranker? Marks difference uh, approx I think uh, 0 0.7, 0 0.8. 0 0.7. Like oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, and uh, is there any another goal or any specific uh, aim you have after this? And that means are you going specific. to attend any other uh, examination or? Any high-end goal? Yes, sir. Like uh, state A, uh, state A exams comes uh, within two to three years, and uh, state polytechnic lecturers exams like that, and state in central level, higher level exams. I, I means I, I, I will give in years come by. Okay, Prabhu. Uh, thank you for sharing uh, all the important things to students and many congratulations to you to get the All India rank. And uh, I'm wishing you, you will also get uh, all in, uh, that is first rank in your state uh, A exams or if you attend any other All India examinations, you will uh, get All India first rank also. So I'm wishing very all the best to you and thank you so much thank for uh, uh, giving this opportunity. Students, we have listened to the story of All India ranker Prabhu and he has said that total preparation done by an academic classes for SCJE prelims examination. Students, if you are also preparing for technical examinations of your state JE or A examinations, try to get subscription in an academy plus to get the success. Students, it is my referral code, Sunilsa SSC. You can use this referral code to get instant discount in an academy plus subscription. To get the an academy plus subscription, you have to download the an academy app from Play Store. Go to the Google Play Store and you can download the Anacademy Learning app and install it. After that, select your goal as SSC, J and AE examinations. Select your goal as SSC, J and AE examination. After that, select the number of months. Enter the referral code here. Here you have to enter the referral code Sunil Sir SSC. After that, click on number of months. Okay. And then you will go to the payment page and redeem your credits if you have any. After that, get the subscription. After subscription, you not only get my classes, you will get all the plus educator classes under that particular category. So one payment, you can access to all the plus educators, technical, non-technical. And what are the educators are available in SSC category? You will get all those classes. Okay. And you will also get recording videos of all the educators. So don't miss the opportunity guys, download the Anacademy app and use the referral code SunilSRSSE and go for the subscription. And students, you can also get free live classes in Anacademy, in Anacademy platform. For that also, you can download the Anacademy app and you can attend for free live classes. Okay, and also so many test series and you can also win attractive prizes. Okay, so why are you uh, late? 
to download the Anacademy app and get the certificate. Okay, thank you so much, guys.